welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can see sa title, ita try kong i-recreate yung video ni Ate Joanna. So if you wanna know how I do that, then please keep on watching. Anyway, before ako mag-start, ipapakilala ko lang sa inyo kung sino si Joanna J.M. Ronquillo. She's basically a professional makeup artist sa France. Kaibigan namin siya dito sa YouTube world. And kakakilala ko lang siya recently and I don't even realize kak kinakausap ko siya and she's basically very sikat sa friends. Ginusto ko yung makeup tutorial niya so why not follow it? Why why not do it? Why not recreate it using my own products? Kasi lahat ng mga gamit niya Ate Joanna high end, very expensive. So I'll be using yung budget friendly talaga. So yes, yeah, so I hope you guys will like it and please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Or like, share, and subscribe. But yeah, anyway, that's that said, let's get on to the video. Please don't forget to subscribe to her channel as well. Joanna JM Bronquillo. Ilalagay ko na lang siya somewhere dito. Please follow her as well. Nakaka-addict yung ganda niya, girl. Hopefully, I'll be uploading this video before sa LS niya. Kasi may live stream na naman siya in a couple of days. Si Ate Joanna. So, may pag-giveaway na naman siya. Pag-giveaway niya is basically a bag. Louis Vuitton bag ang pinapamigay niya. So, guys, kung mapapanood niyo to, kung may YouTube channel kayo, kung gusto yung manala ng cash eh, or a bag, you never know, baka sa inyo na mapupunta, sa na, mapupunta yung bag na yun. So, yeah, i-visit mo lang yung channel niya sa YouTube. I will be putting her link down below anyways. So, other than that, let's get on to the video. Oh, by the way, nag-ask ako ng permission bago ako ginawa to, ha? But, yeah. Anyways, guys, so if you wanna know how I did this look, then please keep on watching. So, disclaimer lang ha, lahat ng mga gagamitin ko are not the same sa products na ginamit ni Ate Joanna. Gagamitin ko lang products na meron ako. Okay, so, let's go. Let's try. Okay. Sana nga maano ko, magaya ko. Sana lang. So, before tayo mag-start, ilalagay ko muna yung buko ko dyan. Buka na tayong itlog. Ayan. So, let's start. Nga pala ha, nakatingin ako dito sa baba kasi tinitingnan ko yung screen para magaya ko siya. So, let's go. Ang ganda niya. Hindi nakakasawa. And she's very, very nice ha. Hello everyone, it's me, JM. Welcome back to my channel. Join me today as I will create a summer glam look with a glowy and waterproof skin finish. What's important to me during summer is to wear a makeup that will last and stay long, especially in humidity. My summer makeup should be waterproof or sweatproof, gives me that glow and dewy effect. The skin is breathable. And most important is, my skin should be protected under the sun. And of course, I want an eyeshadow that will represent the summer look which is vibrant and fresh. And it's very simple. So let's start! Before anything else, let me start off with MAC Hydrating Mist to prepare my skin for hydration. Of course, I don't have that. What I'm using is this face and body mist from Bench. It's basically refreshing, moisturizing, and hydrating as well. So, yeah. Wait, ang bilis niya. Wait lang. So, in-spray niya dito sa mukha. So, next video. Adding to my favorite skincare is this Hyaluronic from Ordinary. Okay. Okay, I have the same one. Maganda talaga kasi to. Very nice. Tignan niyo malapit na nga maubas eh. So, I'll put it on my palm. Tinirecho na lang ba sa mukha niya? Yeah. And to complete the skincare family, don't forget the moisturizer. Moisturizer. 
with sunscreen. I'll be using the Terry Vita White Whitening Facial Moisturizer. My SPF na din. So, importante talaga kasi naman ang my SPF. I'm breaking out. Kasi nga, lagi akong late na tutulo. Okay, so, that's done. To add an extra dewy but matte finish look, I want to put this illuminator cream before applying the foundation to add that summer glow and glass skin finish look. So, wala ko Okay, let's proceed to foundation using a MAC Brush 187. Let me introduce you the amazing foundation which I recently discovered which is called Base of Sweden. <laughs> This foundation is what I'm looking specially perfectly for summer. This is sweat resistant, waterproof with SPF 30, vegan. Yes, you heard it. So, wala ako nun, obviously, pero ang Okay, so ang gagamitin kong foundation ngayon is etong Photo Focus Foundation from Wet n Wild and ang kinuha kong shade is Classic Beige. So, shake na rin. And she use uh nagagamit siya ng brush. So, Siyempre, gagamit din tayo ng brush, be. Ito. Lagay mo lang dyan. Kunti lang. Kasi, I don't really need that much. Kasi, lalo na pag mainit. So, she put it all over her face. is vegan and flawless next i am applying a mac prep and prime concealer which is super super lightweight and i am amazed because it has its own applicator which is very easy to use okay let's go so ang gagamitin kong concealer ngayon from revolution conceal and hydrate so as you can see sa video nakapagkilay na si ate mo girl so Gagawin ko lang to, and then I'll do my eyebrows after the concealer na lang. Nagkilay lang ako kasi nga nakita niyo naman sa video nakakilay na si Ate. So, let's go well, now with our to eyeshadow. I'll just go ahead and put that eye primer all over my eyelid. And let's so, Wala akong ano primer sa And lid. let's play with so, the I'll colors of some. First is with this pink palette from Too Faced. The first color that I'll be using is this Bad to Berry. Okay. So, wala ako yung palettes niya. So, I'll be using two palette. So, I'll be using this Revolution shade, tapos itong pink from Everbelena. So, ang ginamit niya is parang the using is this bad to bury. Dark. May pagka so, pink. So, siguro ito lang yung pinaka-close sa kinuha niya. Ito. Ayan. So, I'll be using that. Kumuha siya ng I just grab that pink shade and rub it all over my crease. Okay, so let's do it. Okay, so nagay niya lang kukuha ka ng to. Just a little bit. A little goes a long way. So it's a crease.
To balance the color of the eyeshadow, I'll also be using another palette from Too Faced. And I will take this shade called the Island Queen and will blend above my face. So, parang darker brown siya. I don't know, yung pinakamalapit na kulay na nasa akin is eto. Here. So, just above her crease. Let's play it. Let's go back to the pink palette and take that beautiful sparkly foiled very eyeshadow shimmering. which is very so, shimmering and brush. basically apply it in the center of my apply it in the center of my eyelid. Okay, so ang gagamitin kong palette is dito na kasi very shimmery tong palette na to. Kumuha siya ng flat brush and then she put it all over her middle eyelids eyeshadow which is very shimmery okay basically apply it in the center of my eyelid okay so sa center eyelid. ng eyelids niya tapos ang pinaka close na shade na meron ako is eto so para hindi siya nakikita basahin ko lang siya konti para maging makapit siya Ito siya nakikita eh. So, ayan, much better. Ayan, much, much better siya. brush. Ito na tayo. <laughs> Hindi ako marunong mag-wing liner. So, dito ako kukuha. Dark, darkest brown. So, maybe it's this one again. Maybe that one. Because it's summer and we want to create a softer look as possible. Oh my god, ang so galing yung mag-wing talaga. Is not in this look. Using the same brush, Okay. Let's do it, girl. I'm not good at this, so... Ah! So scared, huh? Okay. Ayan lang yung nakaya ko, eh. I've done my best. Okay, so... Using the same brush, take the Island Queen shade and apply it okay. in the softer part of the crease. So I think I'll be using... I think she used the same eyeshadow kanina. Then she put it all over her. And just keep going, keep blending it out. So, kukunin ko na lang is the same shade kanina. Shade and apply it in the softer part of the crease. And just keep going, keep blending it out. It's time to work on our eyelashes, and I'm using a curler from Charlotte Silbury. Of course, I'll be using my favorite curler from Nichido. Okay. False eyelashes are just optional, so if you want to give an extra eye drama, go ahead and. So, then, dahil sa kanya nakapag-purchase din ako ng this same. The same one from Ardell. I don't know if you can see it. It's that one. So, ang ganda kasi very natural lang. So, optional naman, like she said. So, put your favorite eyelashes. 
But remember, we would like to achieve a natural and a very light glam finish look. So please choose a false lashes which is natural look as possible. After the eyelashes, oh. working now in the same lower lash, naman. I'm taking this pencil Pinamit brush and tap it in a medium shade. shade. And we'll blend it towards the half end part. I will use this Huda Beauty highlighter and this pencil brush because I want to put it in my lower lash line to create more shimmer. I have this same one, so I'll be just using this shade. Pampadagdag ng shimmer. Spray ko let kasi hindi siya dumidikit eh. And to help my eyes to become more wide open, put a mascara in the lower lash and please take your time to apply it properly so we can avoid some possible smudge and apply it until the upper lashes. Let's proceed in the face. In this look, I don't want to put a heavy contouring, but I would rather use a bronzer or a darker powder just to sculpt the face. Because I want to keep this look as lighter as possible. So now, okay. So I'll be using my bronzer. So now, let's add my favorite part which is called the highlighter. Using a Suevo sculpting brush, I am applying it in the apple of my cheek or in the top of my cheekbone. And also working it in the center of my nose. So, ang gagamitin kong highlighter is etong from a Revolution Palette. Ah! I cannot open it. So, ang gagamitin kong pang highlighter is this one. I can show you that one. Ilagay lang niya sa... Also working it in the center of my nose. For the lips... Wait lang. Ang oh. bilis. Hindi ako makakatch up. Wow. Oh. Well, maybe you guys can see. Ooh. Done. For the lips, first, I am taking a pinkish nude lipstick and I will put it all over my lips. After that, you can choose any dark color and put it in the middle part of your lips. Okay, so I, I think I have, this is my lightest shade. Bakit ako nag english So, ito ang pinakalightest na shade ng lipstick na meron ako. So, and it's kind of like the same as... The shade na meron si ate. So, she tapped it. Kunti lang. I am 
pulsating and pinkish nude lipstick and I will put it all over my lips. After that, you can choose any dark color and put it in the middle part of your lips. Right, okay, so I have a matte lipstick here. Red. So we should just put it... It's a good nap. It's a gradient look. the same darker lipstick and a brush like this i want to use it as my blush so i can achieve the natural reddish and pinkish summer cheeks lipstick yung ginamit niya pero meron naman akong lip tint so yun na lang yung gagamitin ko okay And lastly, I want to put a highlighter in the inner corner of my eyes. Okay. Highlighter or let the shade. The corner of my eyes. I don't see powder si Ate, but I'll be using this translucent powder pop easy set ko lang lahat Thank you.